Hello everyone, here with my stress management uh, video response for PE580. Um, who or what pushes your stress buttons? <clears throat> I think the main thing that pushes my stress buttons or my main stressors are basically when I have too much on my plate, when I got too many things going on, too many things on my mind. I think that's the worst uh, stressors for me, um, especially with work. Um, got a lot of things going on at work. I'm teaching first grade classroom right now. Um, uh, I have a really tough class right now. Uh, one of the tougher classes I've had. And uh, also with school work, going to school in this master's program has been it's been pretty tough just because the the time that it takes with everything else I have going on. Especially the last class I had was very time consuming. And also when I am coaching soccer season, which actually starts in two weeks, uh, that can get pretty stressful. The last couple of seasons have been pretty stressful. Um, actually last season was my worst season ever. So it was when you're not winning, it gets pretty stressful, especially if you got a tough group of guys to work with. I think this year should be should be a lot better group of kids, so I'm kind of looking forward to that. Um, and then just all the other personal things I gotta gotta do along with uh, um, work and and school and soccer coaching. Um, some of the other stressors are some of the coworkers that I work with, especially one in particular person that I have to work closely with. Is she's very negative. Um, she basically doesn't pull her weight. Uh, we're supposed to work as a team, and she's not really a team player. So it's been really difficult to work with her. And uh, when I first started working there, we had a pretty good group of people, but some people moved on to other grades or other schools, and two people basically left this past year because of this one in particular person they didn't want to work with. So I'm kind of stuck with her, and not a good situation, but I want to move on, but with going to school and everything it's tough to change grades right now because that'll be a lot of extra work and a lot of extra learning that I just don't want to do now. As soon as I'm done with this program definitely want to move on. Um, and then some of the my like I mentioned before uh, the students that I have to work with uh, just a really tough group this year and then a few of the parents that I have to deal with also I think those are my main stressors. Um, what steps will I implement? I think, uh, for one, getting enough rest, enough sleep. Um, trying to go to sleep by 10.30 the latest, which I'm almost an hour past that. So um, getting enough sleep definitely helps um, just rest and get my brain uh, to rest and be clear for the next day uh, otherwise it does increase my stress and tension and affects my moods I c could be moody especially in the mornings I'm not a morning person and if I don't get my rest and especially my coffee I'm going to be stressed out um, I think one of the other main things that really helped me with my last class was my time management I finally got myself a daily and weekly planner scheduled out my days and my weeks my month um that really seemed to relieve my stress um as i planned everything out and it it was it made it a lot easier for me to uh, to see that i did have time if i used it wisely i did have time to get everything done and i just basically um like one of the other things is prioritizing setting long long-term and short-term goals when I prioritize things got some of the easier things out of the way it seemed to help a lot instead of trying to do some of the bigger tasks uh, more difficult tasks that were more stressful more time-consuming because I might end up finishing that but then if I still have a bunch of other little things that I still know I need to do it's it just adds to the stress. So getting some of the little things out of the way definitely helps. Um, 
else? Uh, and then also when soccer season does start, I will plan to delegate out uh, some of the responsibilities more to my assistant coaches um, and to my captains. I'm the type of person that tries to do everything myself. Like the saying goes, if you want something done correctly, you have to do it yourself. I'm kind of that way. Uh, but I'm going to have to learn to delegate more uh, just to relieve some of my stress and time that I'm going to need. Uh, and then obviously, like the text mentions many times, is exercise. I plan on exercising. Uh, I've been procrastinating a little bit. I got have gotten worked out a few time, a few days this week. Um, didn't get to today, um, but definitely plan to exercise more. Like jumping on the elliptical machine for at least thirty to forty five minutes. If I only do thirty. If I do the elliptical, I usually will do a little bit of weight lifting that day also. Um, I really enjoy bike riding, especially mountain biking, which um, I usually don't do. I used to do it a lot more, but I definitely want to get back into it um, now that my knee is a lot better. Uh, when I do go to the trail, though, it, it takes a lot more time, so I usually do that on the weekends because i got to load up my bike and my jeep and then go out to the trails it's a little ways away from here but i just jump on the bike from my house i can ride on a a dirt uh, path or on the streets but my, my mountain bike is not as good but if i do that it's probably about 45 minutes to an hour i also like to start hiking again on the weekends and and obviously weight training and strength training and one of the other other uh, techniques I'll use is uh, one of the breathing techniques. I actually enjoyed the the breathing lab that uh, we did for for one of our forums. Um, that really seemed to help, and I plan to use that. I'm going to use that tomorrow. I know I'll use it during class. Um, that really seemed to help, and I'm actually going to try that right now when I go to sleep. Hopefully I'll sleep better. Um, but I think that's about it. I'm looking forward to listening to some of yours, your uh, video responses. Thanks.